This is not my complexion. The boy move away, away from the mirror. That natural light is making me look like I'm light skin. Hey loves, it's a girl in the Mary and I'm back with another video. If you're new here, Karibu Sana, that means welcome in Swahili. I'm talking in a lot because my brother is in the living room. He has his work stuff going on. So I'm leaving for town. I have errands to run. Happy errands. I'm going to window shop for a laptop. Yes, I'm going to window shop for a laptop, y'all. Ah, ah, the excitement that I have. <laughs> Even though I'm not coming home with the laptop today, it's unmatched. But you guys know this dress from my Gikomba haul. It's the one I'm wearing today. Yeah. So I'm off to town. See you there or later. I know you told our friends. I can't take no for an answer. Cut me out like a cancer. I guess I pulled the thread. Then the whole thing came undone. Unraveled into no one. Everybody else is a beginner I don't want to talk, you have to live her Don't worry 
figure out what to do when filming in the bedroom because this light is absurd I don't know if it is the blue background it makes me look so orange I've been really close the blinds just in case it's too much light I need to figure out because now filming in the bedroom is going to be weird that is better I can't be that orange <sighs> I don't know because the only thing that I think it's different is the background I don't know but this is the room that has all the most light I've never thought too much light <laughs> might be a problem <laughs> when creating content because you always want light but I think there's something has too much light it's making me even though it's still not okay but let's just talk I'm going to the cyber I'm going to work Yes, I've been working with my brother's laptop sometimes, but it also has its own issues and yeah, sometimes it, it just refuses to work, same as mine. So because I haven't bought that laptop yet, I'm going to the cyber for about two hours so I can do a lot. The good thing is that my job is normally, I normally save my jobs online, like on Google Drive. So I don't need to carry documents in a flash and go and risk contaminating my flash. I just log in. And I do the work and I log out. Though to be sincere, if it were up to me, I will not be using cybers because the that idea of logging in my information in a public it scares me. But I'm I'm careful. I take time to log out and to do all those things. So yesterday, yeah, uh, 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 I don't know. Eh. I've moved to the window. I think this is better, maybe. <laughs> I'm really struggling with this light, but I'll figure it out. So, yesterday I went to buy a laptop, and <laughs> the problem with me buying a laptop is that I've sold laptops. It's like a medical personnel going to the hospital to get treated. There are things you know you're like, no, no, you're not supposed to do this or this, and yeah, the, that kind of mentality. So, there are things that are I was looking at sometimes they're giving this, this computer and I'm, I'm asking about it and they're telling me this and I'm like no, 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 not that one, what about this one? And then I think I ask a lot of questions that most people don't when they're buying computers because even when people send computers, I normally just see them advertising, they're like oh it's a HP and then they put the picture, it looks pretty. Me, I want to know what's the speed of the processor, what's the RAM, what's the hard disk, is it a HDD, is it an SSD? Like, <laughs> and. <laughs> So that was a problem. So, but I took time and I walked around and I figured out uh, where to get a laptop. So it's just a matter of time before I go get that laptop. Back in the day, I get that laptop. Then I'm going to be so excited. So in the meantime, let me go to the cyber and work, 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 work. Yeah, I think I'll be standing here. This is much better. This is, I'm literally at the window. I fell down, got these cuts and bruises All these wounds turned to scars No such thing as lose And now I stand tall, so my roots ain't moving I won't ever change for the seasons I fell down, got these cuts and bruises All these wounds turned to scars No such thing as lose And now I stand tall, so my roots ain't moving I won't ever change for the seasons Thought it was a race Competing with my friends Takes a lot of time To get to the end All the ups and downs Fighting for the win Now I'm out of town
keep my place steady The grass ain't always green Oh, exactly what it seems I'm just trying to find The meaning in this life I'm exactly on time With my own finish line <laughs> I fell down, got these cuts and bruises All these wounds and the scars Was it in to blame? Where I'm supposed to grow I won't ever change for the sweet oh, I fell down, got these cuts and bruises All these wounds and the scars Was it in to blame? I'm going to buy water I've just come with a small jerry crown I'll buy like I'll add at some point but I just want this one. Mm -mm 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 -mm. It's 7 a.m. they haven't even opened. <laughs> Let me just go home. I'll buy some other town. I'm back in the house and yes I have my bonnet on it's comfortable like that so it's 7 a.m. today's the day that I'm going to buy a laptop the excitement that I have I don't even have to think about it because I'm going to be too excited I can't leave now because one the traffic and there's a day that we left early when we're going to Kikwamba I realized that people were queuing to get into the vehicles like we were in a queue I can't remember the last time I was in a queue. I don't see the need of me going to queue. If I'm not going to work, like I don't have like a deadline, I'd rather the people who are going to work, let them finish. And then another thing is that Taraji requested me to bring her food today. These days I usually pay for her to eat at school. So I'm able to work and do my own thing instead of stopping, fixing food again, running to school. But today she requested that I take her food and specifically she requested for cheapo french fries. So that means I have to be here by lunchtime. So what I want to do is I just want to work until that lunchtime. As I drop off her food, I just go straight to town to buy that laptop. So because it's 7 a.m. and there's a part that I need to submit today. <coughs> the chapter. So I want to work on this laptop. I just want to bendalize it. just want to take it slowly, whatever it can do, up to around 8.30. When the cybers open, when the cybers open, I'll go there from 8.30 to 10.30, I'll do two hours. But then, but then I know I will have finished what I was supposed to submit today, or I'll be closed. Then maybe I can come back and, you know, do a couple of things, then take lunch, then go buy the laptop. So that's the plan. And it makes me happy, then it makes me sad. And I don't know why I always compare myself like that. I'm no icon, but I'm not that bad. Sometimes it's hard to accept where I'm at Lately I get down on myself all the time Wishing I could change most of the thoughts in my mind Caring way too much about the people I don't like Watching all the best parts of their life Now my anxiety It makes me sad And I don't know why I always compare myself like that I'm no icon, but I'm not that bad Sometimes it's hard to accept where I'm at Maybe it's instant gratification, know what I'm saying All the things on the screen that I see that don't mean anything But it makes me happy, then it makes me sad Oh, and it makes me sad Tell myself that I'm doing fine when I know I am nowhere near where I thought I would go Seems like everyone has a map to the I thought I would be able to get ready and then leave when I'm delivering food But I left the cyber at almost 12 11.45 something So that means I have 10 minutes left to take food I want to just pack and take them for It's a bit dark because I have clothes outside And they're right outside 
the kitchen window. So they are kind of blocking light, but you can see me. I keep, I just need to buy a tripod. I'm gonna figure out how to. I don't know. I'm struggling because I'm trying to look for positions where I can put the phone, like on the window, whatever. So I can put it where I want. I can put it just where there is a place. But anyway, I also just bought French fries for myself and my brother. There's no way I can start cooking. So when I deliver, I just come bathe, brush. This is why I prefer that she eats at school. I pay for it with at school because so I can be able to do my things. Like let me say, uh, if it was not this, I would have run, gone to buy the laptop in the morning. No, I'm able to do my things like plan well. Because if I'm taking food for her, that means I can't do much around lunchtime and before lunchtime I need to know what I'm taking and blah blah blah. But once in a while I like to just yes, spoiler, give a treat. So let me just she likes more tomato sauce. First of all I miss you. And secondly, I never wanna see your face. Get that it makes no sense. Oh, but I've been trying to forget that I remember you exist. I'm just exhausted, cause you said you needed me. And I took that way too seriously. So forgive me. Imagine this is it, simple. That french fries is enough for her. And then the fork these mangoes i hope they are ready ready but that's it as simple as that i'd already packed water for her in the morning because she takes water throughout the day so she has water this is the one of the reasons why taraji wanted me to deliver food for her this she sees uh, other kids they get food with this basket or sometimes they come with it in the morning i had a different kind of basket for her because i preferred that one it was it was more comfortable to hold but this one is more portable and it's cute and I know she loves pink oh my goodness everything inside here is pink <laughs> the basket is pink this is pink this is pink I am just a pink girl so like this she was like what are you going how are you going to bring the food I was like with a shopping bag and she was like nah so I, I just saw her face and I was like oh so you want these two bags and she was like yeah so she also wants to feel good with this bag <laughs> Okay. I'm sorry. I don't need my makeup, they don't feel like it's makeup in the way it's supposed to make up. <laughs> but that's not the point. I am going to buy that laptop. <laughs> and I'm meeting up with a friend of mine. He's an IT technician. Let me tell you this. I've had this is going to be my third laptop. All of these laptops I've had an IT technician look at them before I buy. I, I just trust an IT person to look at. Because, you know, you, for you, you may just look at surface level things, whatever. Even the first laptop as I was buying, it, I was walking from one shop to another and calling that uh, my friend. is also another friend of mine. is also an IT technician. I was like, the laptop is like this, like this, the specification. So if he tells me, don't take that one, I'll just leave it. Even the people who are selling were like, is that your husband you're asking? I'm like, no. And the second one, actually, the guy bought it for me. I just sent the money. So they bought it then. So also today, also, I'm meeting up with a friend of mine so he can help me just look at the laptop because he's an IT guy before I buy. Because this laptop is, I think, the most expensive laptop I've ever owned. Most of the laptops that I want, they are these portable laptops, which is good because they, they can fit in a handbag and go and work somewhere. But Linda, Linda who loves watching, Linda who is obsessed with movies, has this stupidity of oh, a, a big a laptop with a big screen like 15 inch and above you see this one this is my brother's laptop so when i'm watching with it i feel like it covers the screen it's so big but ideally the laptop that i'm going for the ones that reach up to here which should be okay but because i watch from the laptop a lot <laughs> i should just stop joking i'm not going to take a wine with a weed why because god will bless us with that tv so We'll use the TV for watching. Even this one, I can still use it for watching. So this is my outfit. It's this to a simple dress. It has to. Is it a butterfly? Yes, but this is how it looks like, and this is how it looks like on the back. It's just a, a simple 
comfortable dress. So let's go. Ain't nobody except maybe you. Is it true love if I don't love? I'd say directly to your face if I was brave enough But instead I will give it a title that matches yours Then listen with my headphones in and wonder what I'm crying for I'm just exhausted cause you said you needed me And I took that way too seriously So forgive me Saying I'm sorry, I don't need nobody except maybe you. Oh, is it true love if I don't love anyone else? Maybe it's time that I start lying to myself. Yes, it is a slim one because it's the modern design. It's the one that has the SSD instead of the HDD. But now, if you open it, this is how it looks like. <laughs> Let me unwrap it. I think I've seen it again. Let me unwrap. Hey! Yes. The screen, this is the uh, outer part, this is the inner part. It has this backlit, little backlit keyboard where you can even work where there isn't a lot of work, uh, light because there's light from there. It's a touch screen. Yeah! I'm here to set it up. So it's a, it's a touch screen, so you can go to the desktop. Whatever. That's it for the laptop. I like this. It has like a silver, I don't know if you can see it because of the light, a silver finish, a silver shine everywhere. Ah, and then now I got the laptop back, the laptop sleeve, I think. So this is where I'll be keeping it so it can be safe. You see the way it is. It's so, so compact. And I also got a mouse pad because this is where I'll be working from. Mm -hmm. And then, obviously, a charger. And then they gave me a wireless mouse. <laughs> hey, it's nice. Yeah, it's nice. Yeah, it's yeah. nice. The mouse is working. Ah, so that's it for this laptop. I am so happy. And it's so slim. Like, I'm so happy. And it's so portable. Ah, I love it. I'm tired because we have worked and worked and worked, but I am happy. I am happy. Again, is happy. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> You're laughing. <laughs> Wait okay, for the milk. Have you ever looked in the mirror and not seen yourself? Like you got lost somewhere along the way Well maybe you just need some help getting back But that's not something they tell you these days I never wanted to be that girl But I'm stuck on this rural street And my smile won't come but my hair still curls I guess that's how they recognize me I'm 
not actually here anymore. I've forgotten what I came. Yes, today is Friday. I'm going to a fundi, a furniture place where I got my I got a couch seat where I got my seat made. So I want to go and see if they can also make a counter stool, counter stool, is it counter or bus stool for me, so it can work for me now, because this is where I want to be working from, when I'm seated here, and also you can even eat from there, so ideally I wanted two, two seats <laughs> for tabaji and rice, but now I try to look at the ready-made, the, is it ready-made, yeah, those ready-made ones, what, the price, the price, those things are expensive, so someone gave me an idea from Instagram actually, <laughs> and she was like, just go to Pinterest, take the idea and then have the fundies made it. Initially I was looking at the plastic ones and I was like, the obviously fundies cannot make the, the plastic ones they look. But I saw there's a way you can also make the kind of wooden or this one that has like a cushion, soft material like for the chair. So I was like, this is definitely something a fundie can make. So I want to go there and talk to the fundi and know how much it will cost and leave a deposit if possible if they're able to make it. So ideally, I wanted two, <laughs> but my pockets may not allow me. So if that is possible, I'll book for two. If not, I'll just get one for work, because I need one for work like this. I don't want to be working from the bed. And then, maybe when I get more money, I'll add another one. So that's the plan. Let's go. Imagine being able to work from here. Like it's much, much better than putting a work desk somewhere there. You see? I'm not actually here anymore. I've forgotten what I came here for. You with the bright eyes. I envy you. Cold and bitter, that's what I've come to. There's no one around for miles They left me here in the dust They're actually all right next to me But it's like I'm a ghost I'm not actually here anymore I've forgotten what I came here for You at the bright are not cheap either way you get them from seats are not cheap but I've decided let me just do one thing and get it over with instead of doing you buying one seat and then I'll come back again let me just buy two so I've paid the deposit for two seats yes they are expensive <laughs> I'll look for the balance for the next few days I'll look for the balance I'm going to sell that old laptop of mine at the people who buy those kinds of laptops which are almost dead I'm going to sell them and then uh, get the money to top up but I must get these seats so I can just work and chill. Hey guys, it's Saturday. I normally end my <laughs> Nairobi Living Vlogs on Friday, most of the time, but it's Saturday. We are going to an event. So yesterday I just left you guys hanging. I, I, a lot has really happened this week. I don't know what I've updated you on and what I haven't. Taraj is about to finish her medication for H. pylori. She got, I don't know, like four or five different kinds of medication. So there's only one left. The rest she has finished. So she's better now. She's not in pain. As for me, I didn't even want to show you my fingers. But this, this is how it looks like now. It is much, much better. It has completely healed because it was about like this. And it was an open wound. Like, we couldn't see skin. So I didn't even want to show you before. But now I'm feeling much better. It's only this side that is left. I realize that this part of my skin is peeling off. I don't know. And then this one. I don't know. This thing is protruding. And it's at, at just a bit painful here. So I don't know why it's protruding like this. But uh, I'll just ask the daughter then if everything is okay. So yesterday I paid the deposit for the counter stools. They'll be ready next week. So hopefully, fingers crossed, we'll get them next week if 
no? If fundis don't behave the way fundis normally do, but the dance made my coach and I think they made it in four days. It was three to four days. We never had the issue. So I hope the same will happen. So I can continue using them. So I'll update you about that. But now, okay guys, okay, I'm so happy about this new laptop. I think this, not I think, this is the best thing that has happened to me this week. Okay, I'm so happy. I've been able to work so smoothly, like I even got up early, I work, yet I just work smoothly, everything is working, I am so, so happy. So now I can even apply for my PIN again, I applied for my PIN in December, it's not yet here, and I've been having trouble logging into YouTube with my old laptop, sometimes I try to, if I put the password, it tells me this device does not support the kind of verification required, a lot of things, so I just always choose another way of logging in, and I was even scared that one day I may not be able to log into my YouTube, but now, now I can log in easily, so I want to apply for my PIN again. <laughs> yeah and see if it will come what i've never told you and i thought about it two days ago when i was going for the laptop was one night when taraji was praying when i want to know what bothers her what she's thinking of i can tell sometimes through prayer so she was just, she was just like god please bless mom with a new laptop this laptop is giving her problems and i was like what so this is partially her prayers being answered and partially my like my child prayed for me to get a new laptop <laughs> I don't know, I just, I know, I feel so honored to have her as my child. I usually say, like, God sent her, like, this specific child, not just any child, not just like, oh, Linda needs a child, let me just give her a child. This specific child, there's a reason God sent this specific child to me. I want to start the next vlog for the event that is happening today, so I'll have to close this one. Thank you so much for watching this video. Mwah! Now up in the sana and see you in my next vlog. Bye bye.